So, um, Anne, why is today important? Um, today I'm going out. And um, well, what do you mean by that? It will have been the first time I've gone out in almost a year. Um, this list is to help me cope with the build-up to the event. It, it makes it easier if the day is broken down into smaller goals. Okay, I'm going to have a shower now. Okay, so um, what's on the list next? So I've had a shower and got dressed, so next is the garden. Okay, um, so uh, what are we doing in the garden? I'm watering the plants mainly, but also it's nice to be outside. You like being out here then? Oh yeah, it's nice, obviously not going out, it's nice to get the fresh air and, and I have my plants. So, um, and I, uh, I found you on a forum for housebound agrophobics. Do you, um, do you want to tell us a bit about your experiences with agrophobia? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's what the documentary is about. It'd be a bit, a bit stupid if I didn't. Yeah, you don't have to if, uh, if uh, you'd rather not. It's okay. No, it's probably good if I, if I talk about it. <clears throat> so, um... Agoraphobia is like an ex extreme par panic disorder, right? So it's anxiety about leaving a place of comfort. Like for me, it's uh, I get anxiety about leaving my house because I worry that I'll have a panic attack in public and I won't be able to cope with it and I won't be able to escape and it would just overwhelm me and I'll be embarrassed and I'll feel like I'm dying. <laughs> that, that sounds awful. See, so, the the... The more I worry about going outside, the the more I avoid it, and the more I avoid it, the the scarier the outside world gets. So I get so worried about what might happen that I just don't leave the house. So it's a vicious cycle. Exactly. So um, so what's led you to um taking the leap now? Well, I've been preparing for for about three months, you know, trying to get the confidence and figuring out how to, to cope if I do have a panic attack outside. Um, I've been taking short walks to the end of my road just to try and get used to it. And um, is there anything in particular you're doing today? Um, well, I thought I'd be more likely to actually, you know, go out and actually do something if I kind of had a reason to, to leave, like an incentive and a, a date and a time. So I um I got this app just to like make friends and I thought, you know, it'd be nice to to meet up with someone and get to know them, you know. Um yeah, I've been a bit lonely this past year. I don't really have anyone close to me, so it it's nice to kinda of have a new friend. Um her name's Jamie. She's she's really lovely, um and she understands about my, my situation, so we're gonna have like a low stress kind of time, go to like a cafe and, and take a walk. Yeah, we've, um, we've video chatted a couple of times just so this is not a shock when we see each other the first time. Um, yeah, she's really, really nice. It's just a bit, a bit scary. Um, I thought it might be nice to, to dress up a bit for, for this afternoon because it's, um, it's been a while since I've been able to Dress up nice. This is this bracelet's nice. I, I think I got this for, for my birthday um, a couple of years ago. These are um these are nice earrings, I think I, I think I got them um on holiday.
yeah, this. These are nice. Where'd you get them? Oh, I think. I don't really remember. I, th I think a, a friend got them for me. A uh, close friend? Um, yeah, they, they were. Uh, if you don't mind me asking, uh, what, what happened? Oh, y you know, the same thing, you, you, you drift apart, go in different directions, kind of lose touch. You okay? These ones are nice. I think I'll I think I'll wear these for this afternoon. Okay, for me to leave at eleven. Then I need to get ready at twenty-two. And it's half past. I only have ten minutes. Uh, is there anything I can do now? Um, no, no, it's fine. Oh, oh no. Uh, shall I just stay out of the way? Um, no. Oh god. What's wrong? Uh, uh, I don't know where my, my thing is, my, my lucky thing, my, my, my charm, I, I don't know where it is. Um. It's alright, okay? Do you have any idea where, you might, where it might be? Uh, maybe my, my bedroom, I, I don't know. Oh. Hey babes, it's Em. Haven't seen you in ages, man. How have you been? Anyway, just give me a call when you can. We can try to sort something out. All right, love you, love you, bye. Hey Anne, just wanted to check up on you. I know you've been having a bit of a rough time lately and I just I wanted to let you know I'm always there if you want to talk. I'm here for you, girl. Don't be a stranger. Okay, bye. Hi, Anne. Look, I know you're not great at the moment, but I don't know, maybe give me a call or at least drop me a text, okay? I'm worried about you, Babs. It would be nice to have a chat. Don't disappear on me. Look, Anne, I'm trying really hard here. I've tried to help, I've called you God knows how many times. I mean, what am I meant to do if you won't pick up the bloody phone? It's a two-way street. I love you, Anne, but you can't expect me to do all the legwork here. Oh, Right, if you're not going to even respond to me, then sod you. This is a waste of bloody time. Bye. Um, sorry about that. It, it, it all got a bit much. That's all right. There's a, no need to apologise. Thanks. You feeling all right? Uh, yeah, yeah. I am. Um, I found my keyring. Okay. Right, so, um, how are you feeling at the 11th hour? I'm very nervous. There's no escaping it now, is there? Yeah. Must be all very scary for you. You've been waiting for this for so long. Three months. Three months? Yeah. And this is what it's built up to. Must be a lot of pressure. So just know that I, be I believe in you. We all do. Yeah, we do. It's a process. Just know that um, no matter what um, no matter what you do today, by like whether you get halfway down the street or all the way to town, uh, it's better than doing nothing. Mm. Thank you. Oh, 
Like it's two minutes to okay. the keys, the wallet. All right, this is it then. Hello? Hi. Hey, how are you? Oh, I'm, I'm alright, you know? How are you? I'm pretty great, actually. Are you excited about tomorrow? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, of course. It's okay if you're not. I know it's probably more scary than exciting for you. Thanks. It's nothing personal, it's just... I'm, I'm terrified. That's alright, I know. We will have fun, though. That's a guarantee. Really? Yeah. Now my expectations are high. It better be. 